I wish I would have been a boy instead of a girl. Oh shit! I just fucking fucked up my makeup. It's all over my hands, but I still see it on my face. So is it up your butt too? Um, let me know. Like I'm looking at your list here, right? So like, one of them is my artwork, and one is college. So you went to college for your art. So I feel like you could combine. Well, I was gonna talk about my experiences in college and how fun it was and everything. I can talk about my artwork and supply photos of all my artwork I've done. I can make two separate subjects of that easily. Places you want to visit? P places I want to visit, like Paris, France. And I want people to know what I want to do, and you never know. I might get to do it. I mean, you've already stuff. talked about teachers quite a bit, and all the different ones. Did I? I don't remember. Yeah, you talked about the one teacher that uh, you think is like the strongest woman ever, and then you got the professor. I did. I talked about Mrs. Ewing. Oh, I did do that. So in, and uh, you were talking about uh, some other teach some other teacher, too. I mean, you know. I'm running out of ideas. You know, do you have, have any suggestions, then, if you don't like the subjects? Well, I mean, I, I like I mean, I mean, like when you're talking about yourself. I think that yeah. that's, that's a different side of you. People want to but, know about me, and, you know, maybe I should talk about mental illness and teach some people some shit. Well, I think you should, I think you should mix it up to, like, some, like, fucked up mini Manson type shit, and then, like, the real you kind of shit. Because we're getting into, like, we're just, like, we're just, like, talking about nothing but <sighs> everything personal about you. You know what I mean? You should have some where you're just ranting about some other person's bullshit or and i wouldn't i wouldn't do a person but it could be a celebrity or something you hate i hate his fucking guts i can run about him but he's a fucking nobody well no not not he's i wouldn't even talk. why waste our fucking show time see you you know thank you for that so much what i'm saying like you got some problem with the government or something like talk like really? maybe all the shit you have to do to get through life just to get your stuff and you know I don't have a problem with your government, to be honest. Well, no, but I'm just using that as some people do. I'm just using. You have a problem. A you do, have a problem with a lot of shit, Manny. I'm sure. I mean, if you can't think of something, you're just frozen up right now. I mean, you fucking hate I everything. Dude. It's just the way my brain is. My brain is nearly empty. I I can't think of anything. Sorry. My brain has gone into a mode where it just wants to sleep, relax, be numb. I hate myself for it. That's why I'm so hard on myself. Let's just do a peace stream. <laughs> no. You know you want it. <laughs> I would recommend you don't do that. Well, I like to. I haven't yeah, done. Yeah, I just think it'll come back to haunt you. I've already done those. Yeah, I know, but you can always say, "Oh, that was a while back." But if you did one like yesterday, you can't say that. You know what I mean? You're you seem like your your reputation's changing a little bit right now and stuff like what that. Mean? What do you mean? What are you seeing from your end? Tell me well, about me. I think the dungeons are showing people a side of you they didn't know about, and they like you. Really. I personally haven't seen one bad comment about the dungeon at all. You seem like you're getting a, a nice support base and stuff like that. When you start going around fucking people streams up and all that crap, like people will go back and they're not trusting you, man. You don't want that. <laughs> Look at them to trust you so they'll end up giving you some money and hiring you for something, you know? A lot of people hired me to do art cards in the last few weeks. How many yeah. art cards have you sold? Eight in yeah. the last... Is that 30, 30 bucks a pop on all of them? No, there were 20 at first. Then after that, I raised it to 30. That's not fair to you. These are the, these are the no. That's why I'm saying commissions. They're not going to hire me for more than that. So, you know, that's what I can get. This. I have to take it. They're not going to give me more. Dude, I guarantee to... you, you could get more than that on every single one of those cards for auction. Like that one for Elisa? Who if you could care about that? If you, no, just, if you just did that Elisa getting beat up card. That had, card, yes, that's a different one, but the other ones no one would care about. Yeah, the other ones they wouldn't, but that's, that's, where, you, that's where you get your money from the commission, right? So if I were you, I would just draw whatever you want, including stuff like Elisa. Well, I told stuff them, like I said, I want $30 a card, and they said, we're not paying that. They said, we'll find somebody else to draw it. That's what they told me. I tried to argue. Well, I would tell them, okay, that's fine, you know. 
Oh, and then I don't have any money to pay my bills. Yeah, that's really what right. you do is you do a card and you put it for auction, man. You're gonna get more money than the twenty or thirty. I guarantee you. I don't even know how to do the auction thing. Is that complicated to set up? No, you just like upload it and you say you say you want to do an auction for so many days, and after seven days okay. it expires. And if they, nobody buys it, then you just have it for sale if somebody wants to buy it. So you fund this? Did you do this in eBay? Did you ever do that? I haven't, but I know artists that that do that, you know. Just and I know to, that another Alisa card and try it. Are we doing any dungeons tonight? Yeah, but I'm just saying, just humor me. Do one card, do whatever you want. Put it up for auction. See if somebody buys. See how much it goes for. When I have time, I'll do that. I promise. You know? And then, and then if that works out, mm. just draw whatever you want to do. Put it up for auction. And if somebody wants to draw you something specific. You need to charge at least sixty dollars for a commission. I mean, I'm just trying to help you, Minnie. You know, you can do whatever. Uh, I just don't know how to do this shit. Nobody will pay me sixty bucks. No, they won't. Maybe they pay you, but they wouldn't pay me. Has anybody given you fifty bucks for the sticker package? Yes, a lot of people. Well, that's what I'm saying. Like, who the fuck would pay fifty bucks for stickers, man? It's not just a sticker package. You get an eight by ten of me. You you get ma five magnets. It's a picture and it's a sticker. Not just man. a sticker like, pack. They're just hey, like you, they'll buy it. They'll buy a hand drawn card for sixty bucks. Believe me. Make a video and you can enter the contest. You can win. I don't have time, man. You know what? That yeah, you understand that. Thank you. Your, okay, your some episodes. I'm getting tired. I can't. Dude, I do a fucking promo for you every fucking day. You do. So, but listen, um, but listen to me, man. We don't have to do dungeons if you don't want. Dungeons are the, my priority show. It's my flag. Really? That's my flagship show. I'm trying to launch. Right. I'm trying to do other shows, but dungeons is not nice. as good as the dungeons. We're the best. I'm not going to ask you again. I'm getting very tired, and I'm about to go to sleep. Do you want to do any tonight or not? Yeah, I'm just you know you're the one saying that. <sighs> All right, go whatever, man. Guess we're doing your artwork. Man, you're faking, dude. All dressed up to act like this. Uh, I'm about to fall asleep, actually. I'm really tired. All right, do the do my artwork. That's the topic. I'm very tired. I've been up for 12 hours. Well, the average person is awake 16 hours. Well, only eight hours have, a day. That. Well, get some caffeine or something. Let's go. Uh, you know, I'm ready to go, man, whenever you want to go. You've been talking, so... You're the one that keeps... I mean, I didn't talk for like... You've been talking for a half hour, and I've been wanting to start, but you don't start, want to... Start, man. I'm telling you to start. Subjects are boring, so just let's just forget about it. Yeah. I'll just wait for nothing. Let's go. Oh, my artwork. <sighs> Come on, Manny. Come on, man. God. No. All right. Well, I guess we'll just call it a night then, man. You're gonna call it a night. Goodbye then. You don't. You didn't want to do it anyway. Just wanted to come. No, here. you're sitting there snoring for fucking five minutes, man. I'm telling you, to, and then you're telling me I'm not doing anything. Just okay. fucking go, man. All right then. Fine. Bye. You don't want to do this. Fine. You didn't why, want to why did you get dressed up? Why did I get dressed oh, up? Shit about the dungeons. All you do is want to fucking humiliate me and treat me like dirt. You don't give a fuck about me. And you don't give a fuck about this either. You said all my subjects were boring. Well, fine. Go shoot it with somebody else then. Look. I'm about to click goodbye. Look, you just, do my, just do my artwork, man. Let's start off. Do my artwork. Apologize to me then. Look, I, you're sitting there. Like, I, first of all, I'm, I'm trying no. to give you advice Ow. to make money. I'm not apologizing. If you don't I'm like it, fuck you. Of if you. If you don't like what I'm trying to help you, fuck you then, man. 
You're not. But I'm trying to help you, you, okay? You're not helping me. You're always telling me I'm a loser and you're pitying me. I don't feel like I should apologize. I don't feel like you should apologize to me. We're working together. We're doing this show together. Let's fucking just do it, man. Come on. We ran out of subjects. There's really nothing to talk about. Look, do your artwork. We're going to do that. Just do your artwork. We'll get this one done, and then we'll see how it goes from there. You always get loosened up after the first couple. The truth is I'm a boring person. I have nothing to talk about. You're definitely not boring. You don't think so. Thank you. I wish I was dead. Well, I I wish I was dead too, but unfortunately right. I'm fucking alive and nobody fucking Tell cares about me. You know what I mean? Now let's get started. You want to fuck with me some more? You're fucking That's with good. me? I would never kill myself for you, Minnie. Yes, you would. No, I wouldn't. There's like fucking no way in hell. Don't no, do I don't have low self-esteem. I have depression. I, maybe I'll turn this into a dungeon. This is what I'm talking about. Fuck those motherfuckers. I hope you're typing it. Fuck them. Fuck them scumbags that come here without. People wait 10 years on the list to fucking come in this country. And they do it the honest way. And when they get fucked by these scumbags who jump the border. Fuck them. Yeah, I have an opinion about it. I usually am not political, but I do have an opinion about it. I didn't want people to dislike me, but they're going to dislike me anyway. I might as well say something political for a change. And that looks cool when the smoke comes out of there and it goes up. Yeah, yeah that does. Yeah, the only problem is fucking YouTube will probably like ban both of our channels immediately. You know what I mean? So I we can't channel. go too hard. I can say what I want on your channel. I ain't going to ban me. You're the one who'll end up with no channel if I say that shit. So you decide what you want to put on there. But all I, I know is I'm like, this is immigration crap. <clears throat> The lady tried to grab my groceries when I came out of the store one time. I'm like, get your fucking hands off of there. You no, know, they've, they've, they've had people that said shit on other channels that had YouTube channels. Not even yeah. on YouTube. They like were on TV or something. They said something on TV. And YouTube will fucking take your channel away. They're not taking my channel away because I'm not saying it. I don't talk politics on my channel or religion or race. I'm I'm saying, be careful even on other shows because YouTube's fucked up, man. They don't have any... Don't have any clear... So worried about it. Don't put it on your precious little channel then. I'm just telling you I hate these motherfuckers. I didn't used to until I started coming here and fucking with us. It's getting real bad here now. All the homeless people disappeared. And Where's all the homeless people I used to see every 30 feet begging, hey, help the homeless. Now I see immigrants every 30 feet. Oh, no, give us money. Like mine, my host family, my mom, dad. One of my brothers, my sister, I have a brother who won't talk to me, and I'm sad. I think about him all the time. If he would just say to me, hey, I'm sorry I treated you so bad. I don't care who you are. I love you. I would forgive him in a heartbeat. Well, I know, I, but you need, well, I mean, I'm not going to tell you what to do, but you keep talking shit. I can't he, get a hold of him. I've tried. He probably know. thinks that you hate him. He does. He doesn't have any connection. There's no way to connect with him. Yeah, he probably thinks you hate him, so... No, he cut himself off from everybody. He's paranoid like that. Nobody can contact him. He didn't block me. He blocked everybody. He turned off notifications on his YouTube, on his music channels. You know, I go listen to his steel guitar all the time. I I don't, like, want to hate him, but I do because of the way he treated me, what he did with the house. All he has to do is tell me he's sorry and really mean it. Just be genuine that you don't hate me because I'm different, because I'm transgender. He probably does if he's that religious, you know what I mean? He does hate transgender people. He hates people that are different. I know he's not a racist. He doesn't hate blacks or anything, but he hates the ghetto, like Chicago ghetto <laughs> lifestyle. Have you ever thought that maybe that's why you're transgender? Why? Because you know that it would piss off your family? No, no. I enjoy the way I am now. You see that I put my image on everything and I love my image? Yeah, but you don't how, seem to be. How many people have to see their own image, let alone hear their voice? You only ever talk about men, though. I've never heard you talk about a woman, so you don't seem to be gay. Well, I guess I am. I just don't go around saying, hey, I'm gay. Yeah. Women throw themselves at me all the time. Have you, just, have you been with a woman? Yes. The hot women who throw themselves this at was, me. This would be a good topic, by the way. Let's talk about that because nobody knows about your. Sexual... An episode. If you think somebody.
I think our third a- recording, I want to do a Mini Manson Misery, Misery of Mini Manson Part 2, because you're going off, and that, and that would be a good episode. But you told me you don't want me to do it, so I, I don't do it. I want to teach people to understand, because it's going to happen to them or people they know. I want to teach them the little things that I go through every day with my mental illness that really disables me and fucks me up, but it doesn't make me a bad person, but I feel like a bad person because of it. Okay, so here's something that I want to know as a fan. I think this would be a good topic. Your sexuality, okay? Your transgender. We didn't do that, many, we didn't do that here. Yeah, many we'll do all that, but I'm just telling you, I'm just telling you what the topic's going to be, or what I would like it to be, and if you're cool with it. But it'd be like basically your sexuality, uh, you know, you're transgender, but, you know, you also like, men, but, you know, like go into like what you actually, it is that you like, maybe give some experiences you've had as a transgender sexually. And like what you've done, if you're cool with that. I can do it. Do you want me to start off by doing one? Yeah, of yeah. This is Mini Man's a Dungeon. Today this we're talking about, my, oh, this today we're talking about my sexuality. I get it. Yeah, go ahead. That's okay. Go ahead. You sure? Yes. This is Mini Manson's Dungeon. I'm Mini Manson. This is my co-host, Grady Takino. If you like the video, like and subscribe. Come over to Minnie Manson's channel too. Like and subscribe at Minnie Manson Star.